Hi everyone, welcome to World Autism Day. I'm wearing my Autism Awareness blue shirt. Eric's wearing his. And now I'm gonna do the makeup first. Um, actually, we'll do that at the end or I'll do it in a separate video. I do have the winner for last month's prize and I do have the new prize. Um, let's start off with bronzer. I already got the base I used. I'll put it all in the description bar. Um, if you see me wince, my flu, cold, allergies, whatever the heck is going on has turned into an ear infection. Mm -hmm. So I'm on antibiotics. Yeah, it's fun. It's a great moment. So it's like every time I turn around, it's like a pain goes through my ear. I took ibuprofen and it's been better, but just in case, I wanted y'all to know. Okay, we're going to use this uh, Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation as a bronzer. Remember? Remember? I just wanted a light bronze just to warm up the face a little bit because I'm not feeling good. I couldn't sleep last night bringing about these because my ear was hurting so bad. So... And I may try to take Eric out and about today just to get him out of the house. <clears throat> I don't know yet. Depends on how well this ibuprofen works. Okay, I thought there was a mark still from the cream contour. Sometimes I feel like this isn't working and then I look in the mirror and I see in the bathroom and I see that it is. Let's use this uh, more precise one to get the cheeks. There we go. All right, we got the face bronzed up. Now I'm going to use the other blush I got from Morphe. I'm going to use Pop of Blush. This is what it looks like inside. Um. That's a bright pink color, but I think that's what we're going for, the one in the middle. You could always tone it down with the other one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit while I was doing this. I found out Eric had autism when he was 18 months that was before I went to the doctor I was a um, daycare teacher for a while when he was little and one of the students in my classroom was autistic and he would do these things like he would look over to the side like this I don't know if it's catching on camera he would do certain things and no other child I'd ever seen had done that and I was Taking care of Eric at home, I hadn't, I didn't have a job anymore. Um, the daycare was running out of money, and they let people go, and I was new, so you know how that goes. And I don't, I don't mind. Um, and we were at home, and I saw him doing things that I'd only seen that little kid do. So I talked to his doctor. His doctor set him up a appointment with a specialist because the doctor saw it too um i'm using that face candy i wanted to use the blue color right here because it's lighted up blue day so i'm using the blue highlight it's called celestial <clears throat> And it took, I think he was two by the time he got finished being diagnosed. And he started different things. Um, he wasn't on medication at the time. I was 
upset a little bit, of course, because you see your dreams become different for your child at that time. And um, I felt robbed, I guess. I don't know how to put it. But then you start seeing and appreciating other things more. Like the things like talking or saying a word become different because you don't get that much. So, or they decide to eat a food that they don't normally eat. It's like the biggest thing ever. He ate a honey and peanut butter sandwich one day a couple about a year ago and it was like oh my god he ate something soft but we're gonna use this one today um for the eyes um your dreams just become different little things because that normal parents would look different at become big things to you um, we're gonna go in with the um, transition shade first. We're gonna go in with like a light color, the light beige, which doesn't look like it's even showing up because it's not. My skin is too dark for it. Um, we'll go in with a little darker brown. I'm just putting the brown down as something for the blue to go into. Cause of course it's light up blue, we're doing blue. But I wanted something to catch it because I've not used these shadows yet. So now we're going to go into, I use this right here. Now we're going to go into like this periwinkle blue, this little light blue right there. And use that as the actual transition. And I don't know which company made which one at this point. I'd have to pick them all up. This one is more ColourPop. And it's called Lost and Found. See, it's like a light blue, which is what we wanted. Transition color is just kind of a lighter color that transitions it. Y'all know this. <laughs> but um, his father doesn't really accept it all. I mean, he acts like he does sometimes and he acts like it's a big thing. But there's been times he wants to give up his rights. There's been times he's told me he doesn't come around because he doesn't know how to be a father to a child like Eric. He uses the word dad. I don't use the word dad. And if he watches this, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, see, I think this is a metallic. What's this one? They're like basically just a tad off. I got the blues and backstage. They're kind of like the same color. It's hard for me to show you, there it is. I think we'll use the Morphe one, I got the blues. And we're gonna stick that in the crease. To me, I didn't know how to be his mom, but I did it. It's something you learn. It's something you have to, there's no instruction manual. There's still no instruction manual. I learn every day different things that I have to do to make his life better. So does Jason. We've been doing school every day. Today we're a little late doing it because mommy's sick. Joy of um, homeschool as you got until they go to bed. <laughs> but one time his dad 
father brought his little sister around and he had um the little boy of the girl that he was with at the time there too it was eric's birthday and they just stood there eric had to get out of his schedule to come accommodate him so he could give him his present for his birthday which was supposedly the reason they came down and then okay let's keep going they just stood there and the little girl kept asking what's wrong with him and I told him, I said, you didn't tell her? I'll tell her when she gets older. She was three. That is the perfect moment, in my opinion, to start telling her that her big brother doesn't talk and has autism. But that's just me. So she didn't look at him. My mom was so upset because they looked at him like he was a circus freak the whole time. But um, they never ended up coming to the birthday party that they supposedly came down to go to. Um, let's go ahead and put, I believe, what is this color? This is Quantum Sleep by ColourPop. We're going to put that down, but we're going to do something else. We're going to put that on the lid. Right here. It's a metallic shade. It's not doing what I want it to do, but also don't feel good, so please bear with me. It's, okay, it does look like what I thought it would look like. Um, they went to the beach in Galveston, because I live near Galveston, and they spent the night. And the next morning, he messaged me and said he was coming to the party, and they never came. The whole reason they came down here was to go to the party, but they never came, which is fine. <laughs> um, that was the last time I believe he saw his father. That was three years ago. But um, some parents can't handle it. Some parents, I have a friend that they seem like they they have trouble with it all the time. You give up your life when you have your child. Anything they need, to me, is what comes first. That's how I was raised. Once you have a child with autism, that changes everything. If you have help, that's great. I have to have someone watch Eric because I can't go to the store with him because it's too much for him. Last time I took him to the store, people in the parking lot thought we were trying to kidnap him because he was having a meltdown and they called the cops. Christmas Eve. <laughs> Another time, next to last time I took him to the store was at Walmart and he almost broke my arm. <laughs> you can't do normal things like normal families unless you get them under control my um he started being on medication when i started college i have a college degree graduated top of my class i have a it's a bachelor's in health information i could run a medical office i could run i could do a lot of things with it but I can't because I decided that my son was more important, which is fine. Now I'm here with you, but, um, he wasn't sleeping at all. And I was doing work for my degree and I would have to shut every light off covered the window and he would get maybe 15 minutes of sleep so that's when the medication started because they're it's all jumbled up in there <laughs> and they don't understand it's time for bed and my grandma i was living there um and she didn't understand why i would let him sleep in the middle of the day when he wasn't sleeping well um you take what you could get 
think we're gonna go with this color. I wanna put it down on the bottom. This is a color pop called Heavenly. It's got a pretty blue hue to it. It looks green, which is what I was trying to tell Jason. A bunch of these colors look like one color, but they're not. They are very blue based. And I'm just gonna pop that right there on the lid, like so. Look at how that worked. It looks like all the same color blue now, but I love this color. It is so pretty. And then we're gonna take our finger and go in this other color. We're just gonna kinda stick it on the center of the eye. It just adds a little more shine right there. And I wanna take a actual blending brush that'll work hopefully. All right, I want to take um, this little smudger brush. We're going to go into that darker blue that we used on the top. And the crease. I'm just putting it there right now. Then we're going to take... And then get sure to get some of the other stuff off of it. Smudged it across like so. Okay, now let me get this Ofra. I think this is blue. That's a pretty enough blue. We're going to put that And he started sleeping after he got the medication. And then it's steadily, other stuff has come. Like he has medication for hyperactivity because a lot of diagnoses are clocked together with the autism. Hyperactivity is one. And you could tell when his, his world is all crazy. Like one time I took him to the store and I had forgotten to give him his medication. This is Denim by Ulta. And he just looked like he, as I explain it, he was firing on all cylinders. I'll get it in a second, baby. This is called denim. He has his medication right now. <laughs> So sometimes it's hard to tell, but I, I, it's hard for y'all to tell, <laughs> actually. It's not hard for me to tell. I know when he has it and when he doesn't because it's a different type of hyper. Okay, got the highlighter, contour. Let's put some um, mascara on. Let's go with um, this Tarte one. Mm 
There we go. Not bad. It didn't quite turn out how I thought it would, but I kind of like the eye look. It looks looks nice. It's nice and sparkly. Let's go ahead and put this on. Okay. Drying it off. Um, lipstick, huh? Let me find. I don't really want to put a blue on for lipstick because it's just. Why is the mascara in here? I'm gonna put some lip gloss on. Sexy Mother Pucker. Want to do. Okay, we got that. But I don't want to go nude either. So let's see what we got in here. You know what? Just for the video. Oh, but it's so hard to get off. Um... You know what? We'll just go ahead and do it. Wow, that's blue. This is... Who's Zooming Who by Too Faced. Let's grab a lip liner. Wow, that makes my face look so white, doesn't it? Wow. Let's go ahead and pull this down. Oh my god. Yeah, we're probably taking this off before we go anywhere because it flushes me out. But for the video, um, just a lot of things are different in a house with um. An autistic child and it's not necessarily bad I can't take my eyes off my lips but it's not bad it's just different I've helped raise other kids so I love my life I really do but I do not like this lipstick on me I'm probably gonna give that to someone who could wear it so, I will see y'all in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions about autism, I'm also going to put a playlist down below. There is Johnny Orr, We'll Get By. There is... Um... Flatline autism song. It's a rap song. Johnny Orr is a country song. I'm going to try to put all those autism videos down there if I can because there is some really good ones that are great to share on your Facebook page. Something for everybody. I hope y'all have a wonderful day and I'm taking this lipstick off before I make the next video. <laughs> Bye.